I look all dolled up. Today is Thursday. I just finished filming a video for tomorrow, which is Friday. I did a fashion video, and so that's why all of this is on my face. The dilemma for this video is I want to do all of this for my face tomorrow to go to work. I don't do all of this to work. I just do eyebrows, eyeliner, lip gloss, and I'm out the door because I touch my face a lot. Some of you know I'm trying to learn professional makeup, that's all of this. So I only do my lessons on Sundays to go to church or maybe on days I'm filming like today. But I want to challenge myself to carry this full face of makeup like this for nine or 10 hours of work tomorrow. Can I do it? I don't know. One, I sweat a lot, so I don't know how this will carry for all those hours of work. Maybe things will start smearing. I don't know if the setting spray will be enough to glue it, to make it stapled. Two, I touch my face a lot, which is a bad habit. Maybe that's why my acne is always very bad. So my thinking is, if I can get past those two problems, it will be a great feat. It will be me having the ability to carry makeup for long hours when it's actually needed. Maybe I have to go for a conference someday. I have to go for a presentation someday. I'll be able to carry my makeup throughout the day without visible signs of me touching my face or like sweat, smearing it and scattering it all about. So that's what the challenge is going to be for this video. Can I have a full face of makeup throughout the day? Up till like maybe seven because tomorrow you want to go out my department at work and I have a full face of makeup the entire day and come back and at least have it still look presentable still look okay not me looking like a masquerade or something so that's the entirety of this video let's challenge ourselves do what we always do let's go see you tomorrow morning it is currently 6.02 Just finished having my bath which is earlier than I would usually have because I woke up early so that I don't have to cool it So my plan is to do the lightest bit ever Lightest, lightest, like that no makeup makeup look The plan is to leave my room by 7am Let's see what we can do in that time This is what I'll be wearing
done now. Turn on the rest of my clothes. I have to tie a scarf too. And that'll be all. I think the makeup is simple enough. Nothing too much. I'll see you at work. Like. It is about nine o'clock. Still here so looking so cute. Start. Still going strong, makeup still going. They're here. Hi. Hi. <laughs> That's my work friend right there. That's Miss Howard with a H. <laughs> and that's Miss Talmage, the tallest in our department. Very serious worker, she's always serious. Why is Miss Lewis? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's actually in the weather forecast that it's to rain. Who's that girl? My belly's are full. Like, I can barely walk. I still in the like tent. Guys, we made it to the end of work. Like, I still look pain, blush still blushing, everything. I guess I'll do my outro once I'm home. But this is so cute. I'm proud of myself. Uh, yeah, so maybe through eight or nine hours still intact. What can we do? And I'm back again for the updates. I don't know where my mic is. <laughs> so we'll do this without the mic. I'm surprised my makeup is still sitting. Take this up, baby. Use the brightness. Okay. So the main purpose of this, like I told you, was to see if I could. Oh, hold on. My sister is calling me. The main purpose for this was to just see if i could have this on for the entire day because i have a propensity to always touch my face either mistakenly or just oh i'm doing this or i'm doing this because my eyes get itchy or i'm just you know just always mm, 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 mm. but i stayed the whole day and i did not touch my face which is kind of beautiful and kind of cute so apart from when i was like this watching movies so here We'll have so many smudges already but i like the fact that my eyes are still highlighted my face still looks snatched up here thanks to the blush and the placement of the blush um my white is even still white which i'm surprised about i was expecting it to have all sorts of brown and red stains and black stains but that's just to show that i didn't you know touch myself too much and like stain my body and i can't believe i still have this woven around my hand and so for me that's just really nice it just shows me that 
if I'm conscious, if I'm really, really conscious of it and I tell myself, okay, this is something you should not do because this is the consequence, it's, I will most likely adhere to the advice I'm giving to myself. So that's a good reasoning to have and a good lesson to learn for myself. So that means I can actually decide to, oh, I want to wear makeup today, even though I'm going to work. And I'll actually do it and wear makeup. I'll just have to wake up earlier like I did today. I woke up earlier. I usually wake up around maybe 6.35, 6, sorry, not 6. Oh my God, definitely not 6. 5.35, 5.40. But today I woke up 5.20. Even though I couldn't get up, I woke up at the end of 5.30. With some days I snooze alarm till 5.50 or even 6 o'clock. But today 5.30, I was already up. I was already in the bathroom. So I started makeup just shortly before 6 or on the dot of 6. So before 7, or let's say around 7 o'clock, I was able to achieve all of this. I know it may be quicker for those who are experienced, but for me, I have to erase and do this and do that and do that other thing. But I really like it. I look good in it and it didn't smear too much. My hair tie is so cute. You know, it's given. I'm happy for this challenge I give myself and I'm happy I was able to get through with it and come back home after about 9, 10 hours and still look very good i have a video i'm supposed to edit today i'm not really feeling like it i'm not really feeling like it i won't lie and these days i'm just learning to take it easy on myself if i don't feel like it i most probably will not do it like if not like i can't discipline myself too but i don't want to discipline myself too so i know that it's not a problem of discipline it's a thing of my mind and my body's tired i should not overwork it so i won't do you understand if it's the thing of oh i'm just lazy i will know that all oh, this is indiscipline but this one is i really don't want to i'm not my spirit is not in it so i'll just leave it till tomorrow and if my spirit is still not in it tomorrow then i'll just post it next week but let's see, I just want to lay down a bit. I may end up just editing the whole thing. And that's just it for this. So remember, you are a gem. Keep acting like one. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.